we showed you downstairs. Now we want to take you upstairs to show you all this history here. Russ, whose room was this right here? This is a madam's room. She was the proprietress of the Grand Hotel. Took care of all the ladies and took care of business. And unfortunately, it's uh, we have documentation through the papers and that that she was murdered by her boyfriend, who then committed suicide himself. So in a murder suicide, she. Uh, was no longer the proprietor, but we've had uh, several different proprietors over the years. I found documentation where a family that had a horse ranch out in Linda also ran a grand hotel. So it's uh, had a long list of history and uh, ran for quite a long time, actually till the mid 70s uh, here in California is when it actually shut down. Um, and then we've got several rooms back here that were opened up into a larger, now they use it as a meeting room, but uh, there were about 10 rooms in total. and. Uh, like I said, until the mid '70s, from the 1800s, it ran its whole life upstairs as a grand hotel. So yeah, yeah. So we think that she might be haunting this place, right? There are several. Yeah, I, I give tours the first Saturday of every month. On uh, first Saturday, all the historic venues in town are open, and uh, I had a lady and her daughter come through on a tour a few months ago, and. Uh, Somebody asked if it's haunted, and she said, oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> and how do you know? And she says, oh, yeah, my daughter and I were in the restroom downstairs, and we both heard somebody say, I want out of here. Oh. And my daughter asked me, why would you say that, Mom? And Mom says, I didn't say that. <laughs> and so, yeah. That's a little spooky. Right. That's a little spooky. Uh, over here, this piano uh, was donated. Yeah. This is amazing. Yeah, the uh, the whole community has really embraced the fact that they've got the upstairs opened up and they're doing celebrating the history of not just the building but Marysville itself. So, um, yeah, it's actually a grand piano. It's one of the you don't see many like this. It's called a square grand. So what would normally be sticking out past the wall, the curved part is folded back over and uh, makes it a shortened version of it. But yeah, Very one of the cool. fam local families didn't have room for it anymore, so they donated it to, to help embrace the history up here. So It is yeah. really cool up here. It's really cool up here. Yeah. One last thing we got to show off right here. Uh, like when you go to Subway, you right. get the punch card. Yeah, or AMP. the punch card right here. What's this? Yeah, you visit visit 10 times, and 11th time is free. So <laughs> <laughs> they, they reward you for your patronage. <laughs> yeah, you know, you got to keep the ladies in business, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, guys. You had a tour of the Silver Dollar Saloon in Marysville. A lot of history up here. Back to you in the studio. Very cool. Thank you, Code.